Hello, hello everyone and welcome to a new update video. So today I'm going to show you what we implement this week to the game. And to begin with, we added a new biome to the game. Oh no, wait, first, we add a secret level to Noblewood. So if you have the chance to finish Noblewood, you can enter here and add the secret level just here. Make sure that you have some friends because it's very, very difficult one. But uh, if you manage to defeat it, just post it on Discord. We are going to give you something special about it. So, so yeah, special level here. And we have this uh, new area here, which is Hope Town. And there you go. Ta 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 ta. Hope Town. Okay, so with the new biome, we added some new tower, which you can unlock with the merchant, same thing as Noblewood, but each level is a little bit dif more difficult, so make sure you are you have some very good tower to be able to complete them. Uh, I won't do explication of the tower right now, we are going to enter inside the level, so we are going to be uh, able to test them live. But I'm going to unlock a few of them, so I can be able to place some of them. I got the slush, slush tower, yes! I got this one, let's go with another one. Ooh. The shooting star. And let's try another one, last one. Don't worry, we will check all the tower. Ooh. The astral tower. I'm lucky, I'm lucky. It's like all the star stuff. Okay, so uh, I'm going to join. I'm not sure if I'm friend with uh, Garpy. Let me add everyone. We have a little <laughs> issue with the, <laughs> the friend thing. Let me just remove everyone and then add them back. Okay. We uh, reset her character like uh, every every time this week, so every time it screw up the uh, the uh, the friend list and everything. So there you go. Okay, so uh, go in the map, Garpy, and I'm going to follow you. Yeah, <laughs> like uh, link set fix soon. So okay, so you have this well that is already started. Okay, there you go. It's uh, now it's fixed. So let's begin. Great. So I will place the tower that I have unlocked and I will let you guys place the other one. So let's just place them one by one. By one. I will let uh, Garpy explain them because I'm not sure if I, I see this one. I see this one, but I'm not sure about this one. Okay. So let's start with the sludge tower. So you can start your explication, Garpy. Yes, uh, basically the sludge tower, what it does, it shoots um, poisonous liquid and it leaves uh, stains on the ground, which is going to poison monsters nearby, but it won't affect, the stains won't affect flying mobs such as crows, only the projectile will. So, as you can see, it let doesn't me, affect the flying mobs. Let me just add the special tower. So we won't lose the game. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> very nice. Next, I want to see the next one. It's very cute. The visual is very so, interesting. Uh, are you gonna place it or? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, I'm going there? to place it. Okay. Next one okay. is the shooting star tower. Cute. Yes. Thank I'll you. skip this and I'll show you what it does. Uh, basically, it's pretty simple. Um, it shoots a straightforward bullet, but uh, it has a critical chance. And when it does a critical hit, basically, um, it can like shoot a second projectile that it's going to uh, either bounce on another target or hit the same target twice. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's a tower that works with critical damage. And I assume the stronger the tower is, uh, the more chance you get and the more uh, uh, yes. bounce that you can have. Oh, exactly. Nice. The, the critical uh, multiplicator is stronger and also you have more chances to have critical hits uh, as as you level up your tower. So. Very nice. Okay. 
So let's try next one is the Astral Tower. Are you reading what, what it does? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I catch you live. <laughs> uh, yes, so this tower is pretty simple also. Uh, it's kind of like the uh, shooting, star uh, shooting Star Tower. Basically what it does is um, it does great damage on a critical hit. But the way it works though, it doesn't shoot a bullet or a projectile. It just like spawns a magical cube that's going to like deal a lot of damage on critical. So it's okay. pretty simple. I'm going to reduce it a bit the volume, so we are sure. Okay, and uh, who made the this tower? Uh, both of the astral and the uh, the other one. Uh, Loic. Loic, yeah, he's a new stagiaire yes. with us. Uh, how, how do you say stagiaire in, uh, in English? Uh, intern. It's a, okay. He's a new intern. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> intern. So sorry, my yeah. French. Okay. So yeah, um, basically he's the one who made the three tower that you just presented. So. Did, did I win like full uh, full round on just uh, Luik for his tower? Uh, no, no, uh, all of these towers like finished them. So okay. I don't think that's uh, this tower only. <laughs> okay, okay. So I placed my true tower that I have unlocked. Now it will be your turn to place the other one. Uh oh. Yeah, sure. Um, oh, it's boards. your fault. <laughs> I think we broke the game. <laughs> What okay, happened? we are making a, a, a small trailer for the, the game and to do the trailer we set ourselves with some special command and link for <laughs> Oh, okay, I them. see, I see. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so you have the this, quest I'll activated on you. So you level up a tower and that goes the issue. There you go. <laughs> okay, I see. J just press L and <laughs> remove it because it will respawn another batch for sure. Okay. okay, so you can continue, uh, Carpy. So, so yeah, I have another tower that is a thunderstorm tower. What it does, it's pretty simple. It spells a cloud that shoots um, really powerful uh, bolts that does a slash splash damage, and it has a debug that isn't supposed to be there. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, okay, oh, I see the pop-up text. Yeah, that's yeah, the thing that's supposed text. to be here. Well, it won't it's okay, be it's okay. Leave it there for the <laughs> video. We are going to fix it yeah. after. So... <laughs> Great, okay. So, yeah. Uh, and when you destroy the tower, the clouds uh, disappear. So yep. you need the tower. You cannot cheat your way out of it. Ah, <laughs> this is nice. <laughs> okay, next so, one. Uh, Another tower that we have is uh, the magic tower. Basically what it does, it charges before it does like a big um, a, a big splash damage shot. Shoots like a magic project tower. It's pretty, uh, does a lot of damage, but the cooldown is big. So like Let's you can see, see how it charges. <laughs> okay, it's very slow, like, it, it charges yeah, yeah, and then it shoots. Ah. But it, do, it so, does a lot of damage. So. so if there's, like, not a lot of enemy, uh, it's not a, a good tower because enemy are just going to go through. But if you have a lot of enemy, then it charges and then it shoots on everyone. Okay. Exactly. It's, uh, you really have an advantage if you, if you shoot, like, in a big swarm of enemies. Yeah, this is nice. Great. Yeah, and um, I'll present another one. Uh, I also have the nature tower, which spawns... I, I have something uh, to say about this one. The first time I read about it, I see the nature tower. <laughs> and I was like, wait, what? But then I read after and it was the nature tower. Yeah, it's nature, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, it spawns magical grass that is going to, going to hurt enemies um, that goes over it basically so it's kind of like uh landmines but with, but it's uh, magical grass. grass okay yeah exactly let me try this one so it's really good to like you use it before a round so you can like fill the map like you can fill the row with it but then it takes a lot of time to put like more grass on the road afterwards uh, so this one is like 
very good for the first enemy that pass to the, the, the maze. Yeah, and exactly. Compare. So you can mix with the magic one that we just see and you have like a perfect uh, combo to that. Yeah. Yeah, you can also use it to finish mobs, like at the end of the road near the crystal. Like you could place it there and you could make sure that like there's kind of a, a protection before they get to the crystal. Great. Yeah, and uh, last but not least, I have another one. Uh, you've seen the cannon tower. It's pretty uh, similar to the new mor cannon that we have. It's the mortar tower. You have to hit on it, sure. but uh, the difference is for the cannon, you don't need rocks. You don't need stones, but for the mortar, you need stones. Okay, so, so when let you me have get stones, some stone. Uh, this one here. Yes. There we go. Yeah, but Link already charged them up though. <laughs> you. <laughs> so, <laughs> you can uh, basically you you hit it and you lose a rock to put the place uh, to to place the rock into it and it's going to shoot automatically on uh, on any nearby uh, target that is in front of it, not in, okay. not in the back. In front of it. Oh no, it's. Yeah. Okay. Well, it goes like a bit on the side. Okay, a bit on the side. That's a wide close range. Yeah. So right now I have some stone. Two of them, I'm going to charge it. No, Link, Link did it again. Okay, there you go. So, two. And I uh, no, don't have any more stone. Okay, great. Yeah. Let me get some. Yeah, and if you don't have stone, well, it's useless, but um, it's really good because like it actually aims on the enemies and it does a lot of splash damage, so. So at really, the beginning of, of the wave, you can just charge all your mortar uh, cannon and then just it's, it's like a cannon tower, but you don't have to stand behind it and charge it and stuff. Yeah, like exactly. That. And okay. you could like make some uh, preparations basically with the nature tower. You could like put some grass and also like ready up some mortars and then like you would have a strong defense at the start of the wave. Mm, we are lucky. Uh, Kate is uh, building <laughs> all the world because I think we will, we will have lost the, the match. <laughs> Thank you. Kate. Yeah, we took our time. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Great, great. So, is there any other tower that we developed this week? Um, not that are ready to put in the game at the moment, but okay. soon are coming. Up. Yeah, because I see there was a lot of new stuff going on, so that's why I was a bit curious. And... Okay. <laughs> yeah. Great. So soon, soon. <laughs> soon, great. Probably for next week. So it's sure, sure, sure we have more stuff. Definitely. Okay, guys, I think uh, that's uh, all about for this week. Uh, so we have the complete uh, Oak Town area. Uh, probably the, the next week, what I would like to do is a secret map like we done for Noblewood, but this time for Oak Town. So even more difficult. Uh, so make sure to bring some friend to beat it or <laughs> try to, to don't die into this as well. So thank you, everyone, and see you next week.